Kamadine, you've had your first few days here on the south coast. How are you settling in? It's been good. You know, uh, everyone is friendly here and um, everyone speaks English, so it makes it uh, easy to understand everything. So, yeah, I'm settling in quite well. And obviously, you had that deadline day where the move was on the line. It was quite a late night. How was all that for you? It was hectic, you know. <laughs> I was, uh, you know, it was a long, it was a long night, yeah, yeah but... Uh, Fortunately, we found a way, and then yeah, that's the most important thing, you know. Straight into the game on Saturday, you've made your Premier League debut now. How was that for you? Um, it's good to know how it feels uh, to uh, uh, to play in the Premier League. Uh, now it's just about you know, you know uh, getting everything right, and you know, uh, making sure we win games and you know, move forward. For you, what is so special about the Premier League? I mean, I'm, I'm I'm yet to experience it, or you know, uh, so, uh, looking at from, looking from outside, you see it's uh, it's very it's very competitive, and you know, they've got uh, great players, great teams, and yeah, it's a place, uh, it's a league uh, you can learn a lot from. So yeah, looking from outside, that's uh, what I'm seeing, and then I'm yet to experience it all, and I'm looking for it. And why Southampton? Why did you pick the club in the end? Uh, I felt um, at this moment it was the right place for me to come, and because. I was looking to play more and I felt like um, here was the right place to come in and get that and improve myself moving forward. And obviously it's quite a young side, you're a young man yourself. Do you feel that's going to help you settle in with players at a similar age range to yourself? Yep, yeah, um, yeah. It would be quite good to you know uh, have the experienced players to around, yeah, so yeah, to learn from them as well. But of course, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go on with my uh, age mates and of course, um, uh, my my seniors as well, you know. And what do you feel you you bring to the side in terms of your game? What are your key attributes? So I'm um, I'm direct, um, fast, and uh, I'm creative. So uh, any attribute of a striker, I think I I got it. You know, I don't have the height, and I don't, I'm not big, you know, to hold on to the balls or to flick balls. But the ball on the floor or the ball in behind, I got it all. A bit shorter than Paul, aren't you? A lot shorter. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously, you are still young, but you have some experience at international level with Ghana. Yeah. Um, you obviously played in the World Cup in Qatar. How was that for you? Oh, it was uh, one of the best experiences I've ever had. You know, uh, you know, I played uh, my first tournament with Ghana was the Afcon, and it's so uh, it's so different from the, the World Cup. The World Cup is it's a whole uh, different game, and yeah, it was a good experience for me, and yeah, a lot to learn from. How much of an honour is it for you to play for your country and, and wear the badge? Yes, uh, it's a great honour. It's a great honour. You know, we we are about uh, 30 million people in the country, and then yeah, you've been chosen. Yeah, it's, it's a great honour. And uh, once you're on the pitch, uh, there's no uh, there's no um, holding back. You just have to give you all because you know uh, there are so many people looking up to you. So many people depending on you. So there's a the bit of pressure there, but you know, and um, without pressure. Uh, uh, we, do, we don't do our best without pressure, we are, we are not getting our, out of our comfort zone. So yeah, it w it's a great time to play for the national team and I'm looking forward to playing more with them. And we have another Black Stars international in our ranks here. How much did you speak to Mohamed Salah before coming here? Uh, before coming here, obviously uh, in, in the national team we talk, we talk about EPA, we talk about everything. But before coming here, he had nothing to do with the decision. I just made it by myself and then when I got here, yeah, she showed me around. And he's still showing me around, we're not done yet, but yeah. <laughs> He's a good guy and then he's helping me out here. Is it good to have someone who's been on a similar sort of journey to you in terms of coming from Ghana and now playing in the Premier League? Yeah, uh, and uh, when you're close to him, you, you get to understand uh, uh, things a lot easier, you know. And that's what I'm doing and I'm speaking to him and then he's guiding me through some stuff. And it's easy to understand when he, he, he's been through all and then he's telling you, yeah. And you've obviously come into a Aside, you've got a very important second half of the season here in the yeah. Premier League. How motivated are you to help the side get out of the situation? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to do uh, to, uh, to give it my all, my all to the team. Um, do what I do best to help the team win because that's the most important thing. And uh, hopefully, we are able to win more games and, and uh, stay in, stay in the league. And, and that's the main goal.